A great gathering of North American wildlife is always a spectacle. And snow geese, creatures of the high Arctic that migrate long distances to winter in Kansas, make a special viewing treat during a long frigid season. But the same social behavior that keeps them close together is always a threat for disease. And recently, avian flu outbreaks remind us that all living things suffer sickness and death when infections occur. High pathogenic avian influenza can strike suddenly and hard. Symptoms are diagnostic, with affected birds showing tremors, uncoordinated movements, and lethargy. Flight becomes uncontrolled. The birds stop eating and quickly fade. Extreme cold hastens death in birds badly afflicted, though many may recover. And unfortunately, raptors and animals that eat sick birds can also get the virus. A recent avian flu outbreak at Kansas Cheyenne Bottoms Wildlife Area killed about 1%, or 2,000 birds from an estimated 200,000 snow goose concentration. On a smaller scale, I personally counted about 600 carcasses in a winter roost of about 20,000 snow geese. The birds died over two to three days, and the remaining flock suddenly abandoned the area with no further mortality. But the aftermath wasn't pretty, and it was a grim reminder about the challenges in all living things. I'm Mike Blair in the Kansas Outdoors.